name is JJ and I'm a student at Boise High School and this is You, Me, and Empathy. When I was a baby, I was really small, while everyone else seemed incredibly tall. But as I grew older, I started to see that people are people just like me. How are you the same as your friend, sister, brother? How are you different? Sometimes I'm happy and sometimes I'm sad. Sometimes I'm worried and sometimes I'm mad. We all have feelings, you have them too. And sometimes I feel just exactly like you. What makes you happy, sad, worried, mad? When my mother was sick with a tummy bug, I knew that she needed a big snuggly hug. I rubbed her back and patted her hand and said, I'm so sorry, I do understand. For once I was sick with a terrible flu, I sneezed and I spluttered, but what could I do? My mother said softly while patting my hand, my dearest of dears, I do understand. That's when she gave me a big snuggly hug and instantly I knew I was humongously loved. My mother was kind and caring to me, exactly the same as how we should be. Who helps you when you're sick? How do they make you feel? When my brother fell over and hurt his knee, he cried and cried in front of me. I helped him up and said, there, there, and sat him down on the kitchen chair. For once when I slipped and cut my knee, my brother was there to care for me. He held my hand and said, there, there, and sat me down on the kitchen chair. Who shows you kindness? In what ways do they show you kindness? How do you show kindness to others? One day in the park, a girl was pushed over, knocked to the ground by a dog called Rover. I knew his name because you see, Rover the dog did the same thing to me. The poor little girl sat on the ground, not a sob, not a whimper, not one little sound. Then all of a sudden she started to cry. Perhaps I could help, it was worth a try. There, there I said as I patted her arm, Rover the dog doesn't mean any harm. He's just being playful, so try not to fuss. He just doesn't notice small people like us. Have you ever helped anyone who was sad? How did you help them? One day at school while having fun, I saw a boy alone in the sun. No one came over and said, let's play. I could see he was sad. He was not okay. So I left my friends and over I ran and I asked if he'd like to play in the sand. His smile was huge, enormous, and wide. It gave me a warm, fuzzy feeling inside. When I started school, I too sat alone. I had no one to play with. I longed to go home. Then a girl called Abby ran over to me and asked me to play near the old oak tree. We gathered some acorns for finger hats and swam from the branches like acrobats. We played for ages, and from that day, Friends forever, we always say. Have you got a good friend? How does your friend make you feel? Yesterday at the big green slide, I saw a child run away and hide. Come back, said her dad, just give it a try. The slide is not so terribly high. So she climbed up to the very top. Slide down, he said, it'll help you to stop. But there she sat and there she stayed wanting to move, but too afraid. I knew just how this girl was feeling, worried and scared, her head was reeling. For when I was little, I sat at the top, terrified that I wouldn't stop. You can do this is what I said, you're braver than you think, it's all in your head. The more and more brave things you do, the easier it becomes for you. I am really brave, the girl shouted down, and whoosh, before we knew it, she was on the ground. Have you ever felt scared? What happened? Tell me about a time you had to be brave. There's one more story I'd like to share about a bully who never played fair. He pushed children over, was mean and unkind. He made us feel sad, so deep down inside. 
But one day at school, I saw a strange thing. The bully was bullied and pushed off a swing. He was sad, he was crying as he walked away. So I followed and asked him, are you okay? His eyes were watery, his nose was red. He looked at me, these words he said. I was mean to the children, it just wasn't right. I know how they feel, I've had a big fright. Kind and caring is how we should be. I know this because a bully bullied me. Have you ever been bullied? How did it make you feel? What did you do? So as I am growing taller each day, I'm learning so much in so many ways. I'm learning that we should try to be kind, helpful, and caring all of the time. Our world is so special, we all need to care about one another and the earth we share. People together from far and wide, we're all on this planet, we're all on the same side. What might be some ways we could show other people that we care about them? So when someone's hurting or worried or sad, remember those feelings I'm sure you've had. Say kindly with care, I understand, I do, because sometimes I feel just exactly like you. When do you feel happy, sad, worried, mad? Do you think other people have these kinds of feelings too? Why do you say that? And how does it make you feel when you see that another person is sad, happy, worried, mad? Thank you.